Hey, and welcome back to Agio's Fire Pit Support Series. Before we start, please read through your Agio Fire Pit user manual thoroughly. And as always, please exercise extreme caution around open flames with special attention to young children and pets. So we've picked a great level and safe spot for our fire pit and we've assembled it. Now we've got to connect the fire pit to our liquid propane tank. We want to make sure the tank is completely closed. So we're going to turn its valve off all the way to the right. Next up, you'll connect this regulator hose here. You'll point it down, thread it here to the connector and tighten it to your tank. All right, that looks great. So now we can open the tank valve. We'll turn it to the left, which allows the propane gas to flow to your fire pit system. Awesome. The good news here is that each of our Agio fire pits has already been tested in our facilities and is CSA approved before it even reaches your patio. This means we've checked it thoroughly for leaks and have already made sure that the fire burner unit is working. But just to be sure nothing happened to the unit between the factory and your home, it's still important to check for leaks. So I'll show you how to do that with something called the soapy water test. Just grab some soapy water and apply it to the tank regulator connection and also to the valve hose connection here. We're looking for soap bubbles. If we see any of those form, you might have a leak. So if that happens, you'll want to turn to the tank valve clockwise to close it. Reconnect or tighten the connection and try the soapy water test again. We never, ever want to use a flame to check for leaks because, well, it could be very bad, injure someone, or cause an explosion. Not great. If for any reason you cannot get a tight connection, you should not proceed with installation or use of your unit. It is not safe. Contact us at customer service at agio-usa.com and we can work with you to ensure that the gas connection is good and the unit is safe to use. Also, something to make note of is that your fire pit may convert for natural gas. To make sure it will connect, check your assembly instruction sheet or with your Agio dealer. If natural gas is the route you wanna take for your fire pit, you'll need it installed by a qualified natural gas contractor or service company. If your fire pit is convertible, there's a conversion valve included in your setup tools. All right. So we're all set up, our gas is connected. Now let's light this up and we'll be ready to roll.